International Noise Awareness Day aims at giving attention to the implication of noise on the welfare and health of people worldwide, with more population using power generating sets due to poor electricity supply and other personal or industrial activities that generate noise. A consultant ear, nose and throat surgeon, Dr. Ngozi Onyagwara, says there is need for awareness on dangers of exposure to noise for residents in urban and rural areas as the intensity of noise and frequency of exposure to noise has health consequences. There are other uh, forms of uh, ill health that is affected by noise, especially stress. You find yourself, if you hear noise all the time, you find yourself be being very uncomfortable. And some people are known to sleep with less noise. Any increase in noise generates a lot of cortisol in their system and cortisol accumulating in their body affects their heart. Some residents comment on some activities that can predispose them to hearing loss and other mental health conditions. You have heard the head, but the eardrum sometimes, when you're shouting, the thing is vibrating. Sometimes after the noise leave the place you are, you're surprised that you cannot even hear very well. Yeah, it's very rowdy in most cases. Even affects your mental stability. Before you talk, you shout, you know, siren like you can see everywhere. Affects you. It's not. I mean, it's not conducive for us. The federal government they give us light. That light might be a problem with all these things. Because if light is there, then you can't unjourn. The International Day was founded in 1996 by the Center for Hearing and Communication to encourage people to reduce noise at workplace where they live and play. Gainsley. Which reporting.